Um, I want to go over this little uh, update that I'm making right now about the growing towers. I have a lot of them. I want to show you this section. And, you know, as you can see, the peas. I mean, I have some peas. I have a strawberries. I have some strawberries that are growing really well. They are adapting really well. I have a lot of, um, you know, areas open. But I have strawberries. I have sweet peas. I have mint. I have peppermint. Uh, I have other plants that my, my son planted a little, you know, other plant around, but anyway, they are growing, they, they, they love the place, these are, these are mint plants, you know, as you can see they are just growing a lot, they adapted really well, the peas are crawl, you know, crawling in this kind of leftover mesh that I found, I like to use a lot of recycled materials, in fact, all the, the greenhouse over here was built with, with panels, um, you know, that I took from, from other projects and other stuff, recycle, reclaim material, I try to maintain myself in a budget that, um, that you know, that can encourage people to, to do it themselves, because this is not about spending money, having the best materials possible, but, you know, working with what you have in your area. So, uh, I want to give you a little bonus. If you notice, I have this nice little tower, growing tower. I have cilantro in this one. I just transplanted them like five days ago, and they are taking it really well. They were tiny. But um, what I did is that I used the caps, you know, openings on the top, opening on the bottom, and I used the cap and then some little, you know, dripping things connected to a main system that, that is connected to all the, the growing towers. And I'm using gravity. In this case, I'm using gravity to, to you know, provide water for all the systems that I'm, that I'm working with. And, you know, and then that's how, that's how it's working. So excuse the mess. But I uh, just want to, you know, as I go, because I have other, I had other systems and other stuff outdoor, outdoors, and I found out that if I get all these reclaimed windows from window companies, they, they give it to you for free, because, I mean, they have to get rid of all the old windows, and these windows happen to be double glass, so for insulation, it's really good. I'm going to show you a little bit of the outside and, and show you how, how the final product start looking like. See, let me try to uh, bring you here. And as you can tell, the greenhouse with, you know, uh, reclaim bricks and some little of creativity and paint, um, you know, they look really great. They look like a, like a really expensive greenhouse that you can actually build with reclaim material. So um, that's the little update. The strawberry towers grow. I mean, they, they work really well. Adjust them a little bit. I mean, just, just as you go, you can play with them and, and try to make sure that they drain into whatever bed you have. Probably it's easier to drain them directly to a tank. So, you know, you can plant them right on top of them. But anyway, thank you so much for watching. And I hope that little update can just encourage you a little bit more to grow your own food. Okay, bye-bye.